what's happening guys we are back at it it is about 38 degrees today and uh you know yesterday was about 72 which is insane i think the high is about you know maybe 48 today the wind's about 14 miles an hour coming from the north so we're going to try to stay on the north side not the north end but the north side of things to kind of protect us from that wind but uh the water temperature i'm not sure exactly what it is right now but it is cold i had to bundle up like i mean i got layers on top of layers and uh we're gonna go out here and we're gonna try to target crappie and uh what i want to try to do today is show you uh, my settings on my forward facing sonar specifically for my crappie jigs and uh, kind of how I set it up and range it to you know target these brush piles or uh, large groups of crappie kind of roaming or just how I kind of set it up in general so let's go all right so I was coming into this creek here and then as I was coming down this way I don't know if you can see this but I've seen a lot of treetops. I mean, there's so many of them. There, there, here, 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 here. Uh, some right here. So, um, as I was coming around this bank here, when I saw this, I was like, you know, maybe I'll come in here. Let me just come in here. And uh, I started coming down this way. And right over here, actually, these little posts here, I caught some decent ones right here. Uh, saw some stuff over here. Yeah, so the first thing, you know, I have this set at 75, um, and usually if I'm fishing 14 foot, I'm going to set the, the range to 14 foot too. Uh, as you can see in front of us, we have those two posts right there. There's one, here's one, and that's about 40 feet out, and as you can see, about 30 feet, we got some crappie right here, but that's not where we've been catching them. Uh, and if... I sound like I've been eating ice. I mean, it is unbelievably cold <laughs> and the wind is coming right at me. So my face is frozen. Um, so, uh, let's see, I'm going to, I'm going to pan over. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. So that tree right there is where I'm catching them. So, you know, it goes from 60 and it comes all the way to about maybe 35, 40. And as you can see, there's there's a tree here and then all these little dots and little spots out here are all crappie and uh what i'm doing is i'm throwing that small one eighth ounce jig head with that little crappie jig on it that soft plastic and there it is again and as you can see it's in about five to ten foot of water i'll throw it up here and just let it work its way down here and that's where we've been getting bit and the tree i think is actually laid down from here to about here because this is where i've been catching them and when i pan over i can still see the tree about right here not all the way up at the bank it's like kind of out a little bit further probably around this area here but that's that's what we see right here so this is what i saw i've been casting that little jig in there and that's what that's where we've been catching them so real quick about my my settings um let's see i have it on 50 um, percent forward display mode um sensitivity is 14 contrast is 15 high i got it set at 75 and my down range is 35 but um my jig tracking is is really really good that eighth ounce i don't know if i can do it but maybe let me see if i can uh make a cast and see if we can just see how far out we can actually see it all right so bear with me this is going to be the little crappie jig right here that we're going to be throwing it's a 1 8 ounce as you can see i was snagged up the hooks a little bent out but and then i'm going to line up into this wind the best i can to make a straight cast and uh you know i'm, I'm not going to try to get it super super far but i just want to show you you know about how far you know this jig will track so let's see let's try to get a straight cast all right so it just hit and there it is dropping right there right next to that log and that's about 30 feet out and that was just a light cast because i just want to show you guys and it's going all the way down to 15 foot so that's my jig tracking that's my setup y'all need to get out here and pan around and find those giant laydowns with huge crappie in them and catch you some dinner. Ha, <laughs> 
to bite on any other color. There she is right there. Decent crappie. She's warm too. So there you have it guys, catching giant crappie on that Bobby Garland and that 1 8 ounce jig head again. 
guys that if you're not really sure how to locate these fish um, I have a video I'm gonna link it down uh, not down but at the end of this video here and you know that's exactly how I, I find these fish I you know scan down and around get on my forward facing sonar locate them you know anchor out and you know cast away but uh, guys I, I appreciate you watching continue to follow Bass One Buddy and I will see you next time peace Thank you.